Alright guys, it's your boy King Reptar here, back with another video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day, and if you guys are, you know the drill. Camera flip. It's about to get a whole lot brighter because you're a whole lot darker as I said last time. But a whole lot brighter because your boy is here. But a whole lot darker because you're not your boy is here. <laughs> <laughs> not, not, not your boy uh, currently. Your boy hasn't been around for a while. <laughs> He's very, very dried up. So right here, we have the rest of the dark web mystery box. If you guys are new here, there's a video. If you guys loved it, I think it has like almost a million views. Links down below below to the last episode of the dark web mystery box I went online I found this box and essentially what it means by dark web weapons is just weapons that you really really should know <laughs> like no one should own them it's not something you can get at, like Home Depot it's like stuff that probably shouldn't be legal and if this skull on the front of it wasn't any detector or what kind of what kind of twisted website this is I don't know what else is so we're gonna get into the box we're gonna open some of this stuff up and then we're gonna go outside and test it I have no clue what is else is inside of here but I also found out there's a bonus item guys that wasn't even inside this box they sent I didn't really know it went to this box because it wasn't packaged like this and the thing is it it's a table! Oh. Grand reveal! Oh. It's a table! It's, it's a dark, dark, very dark table. Dark web table! You, oh man, if you lay it on this table, it'd burn your whole body. Oh crisp. man, just get a couple of candles and sacrifices. <laughs> if you were to open the top of this table, oh, you would see that it's just filled with baby's teeth. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, babies don't have teeth. You ever wonder why they don't have teeth? Because they're on the table! <laughs> All right, so here we go. We're gonna open up the box and see what the next item is. There's not a lot left in here, but I know there's a few items left. Let's see. Oh, oh yes. I feel something cold. Uh, and I'm not wet. Okay, not wet. Good. Yeah, I was just okay. saying. <laughs> this isn't, isn't always good. Dude! <laughs> what the? Let's flip it. Oh! <laughs> I just saw the bullets. I'm like, what is it, like a, like a bullet chain? <laughs> okay, so we have... It's a knife again! It's a knife! I forgot. I, every time we open one of these, I think that it's just the knuckles. And then I look again, and I'm like, oh, it's a f***ing knife. Oh, that's sick. That is sick. That is... It's like, <laughs> it's dark. This looks like a drive-by. <laughs> this looks like a typical home in Compton. <laughs> We're gonna go outside, and oh, I've got six shots. I'm ready to use. There's seven. I got seven shots. <laughs> and I'm ready to, to, to do something with it. I got a lot more confidence. Right here we have the M Tech knife. I don't I guess it's by M Tech. And it has these bullets. So we're gonna do these bullets do because God that looks painful. The oh, other one had yeah. spikes, but it's like this man gets shot by a by a Uzi. <laughs> or did he, or did he get punched in the side. <laughs> well you forgot to mention one thing. If you flip it over, it's extreme. <laughs> okay, alright, so let's see what these bullets can do. I'm actually not gonna punch it that hard. I just wanna see what kind of imprint these make. Alright, here we go. Ready? I just wanna oh, see I'm what ready. these bullets are gonna do. Three, two, one. Oh! Dude! <laughs> that was insane. <laughs> Look at the wounds, dude. It literally was like, like a, just a machine gun. Just in that <laughs> one spot. Yeah, wow. That is dope. Okay, I'm gonna do it one more time. Let's do it in slow mo. Oh, and it splits it. So not only does it split it open, it just also just leaves those holes and then completely splits it open. And then, let's not mention, it has a knife. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> oh, man, yes. that slapped it. It didn't just slap it, it just sculpted it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what we're gonna do, I think this will be a better representation so we can see exactly what these bullet holes are doing. So here we go, ready? Without it actually splitting in half like the watermelon. <laughs> oh, dude, I'm not even gonna move. <laughs> Damn. Dude, <laughs> I'm not even gonna move because when I do move this, ready? Not a drop was wasted. Oh! <laughs> All the drops were wasted. <laughs> Dude, that is so sick. You can play a song on it too, it's so I sick. Know, right? <laughs> that is crazy, dude. And this is how you make a really, really cool crop watering system for free. And you. Oh. <laughs> oh! <laughs> got the handle! I got the handle. And I also got the f***ing handles. Oh, they're gonna like put like an Instagram thing down below or something. Oh, the handle. Here we go. Slow-mo bullet punch. I'm gonna start calling this the bullet puncher. The bullet puncher. It's like the hole puncher, but the bullet puncher. Alright, ready? Ready? Three, two, one. Oh! oh yes! Oh, you know yeah. I thought that was gonna hurt, but then somewhere down the line, I was like, I'm a bullet. Nothing stopping <laughs> me. I'm a bullet. And it so this is the bullet. So let's go ahead and use this for a few more of the things. <laughs> All right. So like I said, let's not forget it's a freaking knife on the same at the same time. I've just been a little bit obsessed about the bullets because that's just weird and awesome. So here we go. Ready? Oh yes. Oh! oh! Holy crap! Oh. It's straight through the cap, dude. This is almost as strong as a karambit. Wow. That is disgusting. It is as sharp as a karambit. 
but with bullets. My curiosity though is because these are not very sharp. Like, do they puncture or would this just leave you really bad bruises? Or would it really puncture into you as if like the melon it did? Well, I think this is much, much, much harder than our skin. Much, much, and you guys know these things are indestructible. I was very, I'm, I'm every time I just get scared. I am never scared of this thing, dude. This thing You're is never always scared. Never scared. I'm never <laughs> scared. <laughs> when I drop this soda, I'm never scared. Three, two, one. I told you. God damn it was. Yeah, I told you. <laughs> yeah, you told me and you get the proof all over your damn face. No, I, you, I <laughs> told you. I didn't need the proof. I know, I just wanted to make sure everybody knew you had <laughs> your pants. I have Sam on my pants. You like, have Sam on your pants. Don't tell your girlfriend that. <laughs> I've got Sam all over my pants. <laughs> this little Sam DNA, that's all. <laughs> it's actually not that bad of a drink though. <laughs> yeah, but you have Sam in your mouth. All right, so what I'm going to be doing now is I wanted to see if it was throwable, but we're doing the dark web, and I, I wanted to see can I do a dark web throw? <laughs> dark web throw? So here's that over there. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to act like I'm just like anybody else. I'm just a normal man. But in reality, I'm a serial killer. Damn, that was cool. That was real cool. This smells really good. Hey, we gotta get this off the wall before it stains the fence. Vans, off the wall. <laughs> Vans, off the wall, and always landing flat. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my what? god. This is a thing. This is supposed to work. What the f***? <laughs> Damn it. All right, guys, so this is the last test. I've been having a lot of fun with this thing. It does not have a glass breaker or like a big sharp piece like the other one did, but it has something here. So let's see if this thing can work for a survival knife. I mean, it's full tang. It's full tang. Full tang. Pooty tang. Uh oh. Pooty tang. This is gonna be a little bit different than normal because if I don't, if it doesn't break, I'm gonna hurt my hand. If the table normally doesn't hurt that much. Three, two, one. Uh, did you see a stick it's to it? Right <laughs> into it. Oh my god. I just impressed it. You impressed it? I impressed everyone. <laughs> Including <laughs> coconuts. <laughs> Including the most cocoa we've nuts. <laughs> Three, two, one. Okay, let's Ooh. keep hitting it. Not as easy as the other one for sure. Oh, okay, there we go. Oh. We made a big mess and I wasted all my coconut water, but we got it open. <laughs> the other one had a much better glass slash stabbing thing in the back. I mean, that's probably not what it's for, but the fact you can't use it for that. Yeah, it's probably for this. <laughs> Damn. And it's really good at that. Yeah, it's great at mm, ruining lives. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like my ex-wife. <laughs> <laughs> and her attorney. <laughs> and the second one, too. <laughs> all right, so that was awesome. Let's get back into the box, all right? Let's see what else we got in here. It's getting really empty, though. It's getting hard to find stuff. Who says it? It's getting really empty. <laughs> Just like my soul. <laughs> I, was, I was just thinking, like, when you look in your bank account, oh, it's getting really empty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> okay, um, this, if this was one of the first items we pulled out, I would be really nervous. Because now we know <laughs> that there's nothing that crazy in here. Because this looks like a brick of something. Like a brick of El Chapo, like this looks like El Chapo's booster seat. <laughs> like this, if you get what I'm trying to say, this, this is El Chapo's breakfast. <laughs> I mean, it's a good thing that they left this little, this little Well, yeah, because, you know, this right here, this is, it's not called the black web. Oh. You gotta have a little bit of light coming through for it to be the dark web. Oh, yeah, so that's yeah, why yeah, they leave a little way. bit of light. But, I mean, if they call it the black web, that, that's just that, racist. Yeah, it's it 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 a whole different thing. <laughs> that's a whole different part of the internet. We're not going. All right, so now let's get this thing open. Let's see. Did you just grab another knife? You you got a knife. I want to keep that one new. This is an old piece of sh**. <laughs> Dude, there's aluminum foil in there. What the heck? I'm not sure if they're like trying to keep it like temperature regulated. I'm not sure. Let's get this through. Oh, maybe like uh, insulation or something. I have no clue. All right, got it. Feel, like hot or cold or? It doesn't feel hot. It doesn't feel cold. It feels illegal at this moment. <laughs> I can't even get all the way on to pull this thing out. Okay, so there's still more aluminum foil in there too, but we're- I expect that crafting shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it should work for Trojan, for real. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> <laughs> nothing can do that. Cause Robert's working there now, <laughs> it's working. I got three motherfuckers <laughs> rocking around here for evidence. <laughs> I, I don't have kids, okay? Just so you guys know that. <laughs> Alright, let's come on, let's go. Let's see if they can look at this now, okay. Okay, okay. Very slick bag, comes in a bag, so that already makes me a little bit curious. Oh my gosh! Do you know what this is? That's what I just asked you. What is it? <laughs> this is a taser! But not as a taser! What? I mean like... No! <laughs> like the ones the police use? No it's not! Come on! This is... Dude, 
<laughs> it has the cartridges right here. Oh um, my! I've seen that from movies. <laughs> I've seen it from right from dark web. <laughs> Holy crap, so right here, I'm actually a little nervous. I don't know how to handle these kind of things. So it's got this switch. Oh my god! That was charging up the shot. Holy crap, this is not something we should be playing around with. Okay guys, so they put foil around it because they didn't want people to know what was in it. Okay, we're going outside. Dude, I was just reading the instructions, right? And so it turns out that if you don't have those cartridges, it acts as a stun gun by itself. What? Yeah, when you touch someone. It's like it's a regular stun gun. Yeah. I don't so know why I really. So it's <gasps> oh my goodness, dude. Whoa, get that that away is... from me. Did you see how big the bolt was? I Whoa, don't care. Who wants put it, it against your shirt so we can see it. Put it against your stomach so we. <laughs> <laughs> that is insane. You know, guys, I do a lot of taser stuff. There's no damn way I am letting this touch me. Oh, wait, right there. Please! Just stop! Oh, I'm finally gonna shoot this motherfucker. Once and for all! Ah! Yeah, 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 let's do it, do it, do it! <laughs> So nice junk down there, Parker. All right, you know, on some channels, safety is a number one priority. On this channel, usually it's like, I, I say first, but usually it's somewhere like the third or the fourth. <laughs> but today is number one. So I put a rubber glove on to make sure I'm not gonna electrocuted by this thing. We're gonna put this in there, I guess, and, and see what happens. Just don't touch anything else while you put it in. Push it in with the wall. There we go. Okay, I didn't want to touch it any more than I had to. Okay, let's, let's be very, very uh, barrel safe today. Barrel safe today. <laughs> right. Three. Two, one. Oh, oh my <laughs> God. Dude, do you hear this? It's so, do you smell this? Oh, yes. <gasps> oh my goodness. This thing actually worked it right now. Popped. You, it popped like one of those party poppers. <laughs> it really did. But listen, so no electricity. There's voltage going into that right now, guys. There's no real way to demonstrate what's happening, but right now, you can all, and it does a little bit of movement, but that's actually all that happens. There is no way we can physically show you without uh, physically showing you, which isn't gonna happen. All right, so Parker's gonna give you a close up on what the actual. Wow, that thing will stab right into you. Damn, dude, that thing literally would go straight into your skin. <laughs> It'll go right into you and then just voltage. Okay, so first off, I've got punctures and then electricity going into said punctures. That's insane. Three, two. Oh, I missed those ones, man. <laughs> man. See, I missed it because it was a small target, but if this is a body, those all would have been in it for sure. So what the goal is, guys, I'm gonna plug those two things into a piece of meat and see if something happens. Like maybe, I don't know, I don't know what to, I don't know what to expect, but let's just see what happens. Dude, okay, I'm not trying to mess with you. Do you smell that? You know what? I actually can smell something, but I can't see anything. And if I can't see it, then I don't believe it. And that's how this country was built. Oh, oh, dude, wait. you see it's burnt right there? There was electricity going in. Not the most eventful thing, but you can see some electricity did go in. There's no way to really display this, guys, but if it hits you, you'd feel it. It would, you'd, you'd, you'd feel it all the way to the ground. All right, so we're gonna try the water jug too just to see what happens, here we go. Nice, <laughs> someone drinks it. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I heard about these electrolytes. <laughs> man, those are great. Here's Daniel. <laughs> oh, what flavor is it? Oh, it's electric lemonade. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we're gonna move on from this. This is amazing. The problem is with electricity, you can't really see anything happening. You just know what yeah, happened. Unless you have some keys and a kite. <laughs> yeah, unless you have some keys, a kite, and then a death wish. <laughs> All right, so the last item is under here, and it's very peculiarly shaped as you can oh, tell. <laughs> what the hell? Like, what's up with this Game of Thrones ass blanket? <laughs> <laughs> this is this is my this is my old dog. I used to have a dog before before. Daisy, and it's much bigger. It's very sad. <laughs> this is the last black bark I've had. I opened it because it came in a normal box. That was like a skull box. I thought, oh, it probably would look the same. So I didn't realize. I opened it. And are you ready to see it? Parker has no clue I, what it is. I now. know what it is, yes. Three, two, one. What? <laughs> yes! 
<laughs> that is so awesome. If you guys haven't been here before, we had a Lucille bat before, but this one's actually a little bit nicer. I didn't anticipate, I, didn't, I mean, I didn't know what was gonna be in the box, so. But we have a freaking Lucille. <laughs> Dude, that's insane. <laughs> and this one's way sturdier than the last one. The other one was made of like a cheap wood. This one's oh, a no. real hard, solid yeah, wood. On wood. Oh my God, it feels amazing. This looks way better than the last one. All right, so we're gonna take this thing outside and let's uh, just go bust some heads. <laughs> All right, so we shot that thing with the uh, the taser. It didn't do anything, but I don't feel like moving it, so. <laughs> oh, 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 that yes. was the most accurate thing to Glenn I've ever seen. <laughs> oh, man. Sorry, Glenn. Good thing there's no Abraham. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. That thing's straight up stuck in the middle of it. That was... Honestly, that was awesome. That was, that was amazing. Of awesome. So, if you guys don't know how this works, basically the reason why barbed wire makes it a lot more dangerous of a bat is in a zombie, you know, slash apocalypse, you would be able to use the barb to at your swing. Literally, barbed wire is used to snag onto your skin and your clothes. Even hopping over gates, going in between fences, that kind of stuff. So if you swung it, it would literally grab onto a zombie's flesh as you're swinging. I'll show you examples. What? You didn't go as hard, did you? <laughs> I didn't go that hard because I was really nervous. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? That's destructive. <laughs> God damn. Soda shield. <laughs> <laughs> when it's been one month and she finally touches it. <laughs> oh! God! <laughs> yeah, blue balls will do it to you. Okay. All right, Mel and Tess are going to be able to scrape. Oh, dude, that looks sad. Man. <laughs> What's this? <laughs> oh, you hear that sound? <laughs> yes. I heard that sound. It is a scary sound. <laughs> oh, oh, you, oh, you got something on your cheek. You got something on your cheek. <laughs> Can you imagine somebody who's just like a back scratcher? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got a scratch there, Jimmy? Oh, let granddad scratch your back, Jimmy. Let me see your good night scratch, Jimmy. You like that, Jimmy? It feels good, right, Jimmy? Jimmy's just, ah! <laughs> All right, Jimmy, you ready? Move it, Carl, you're useless. <laughs> Three, two, one. Oh! I'm just gonna leave it right there. Split it clean open and watch this. Do you see that? Oh no. It's coming straight out the barb. Look at the wound it left, dude. That actually is pretty sick. <laughs> that is awesome. Now let's finish him off. Now he's finished all over that wall! <laughs> oh. Someone asked for a soda? Well, you, you don't want one over there. I think that one, <laughs> those two planks asked for that. Yeah, they got it. All right, so here's what we're gonna do for the test on this one. We're gonna do the cinder block test. See if, you know, the wooden bats usually aren't able to do it, but maybe with barbed wire can. If it does that, I definitely think that the, you know, skull that busted open in Walking Dead was accurate. You think Walking Dead? <laughs> Walking Dead. <laughs> yeah, it might as well be after that scene. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. All right, you ready? My glove I, is- are, I'm ready, are you ready? I'm getting ready. My glove is getting ready because the last time I've done this, it almost broke my hand. No joking. I felt like it was going to. But the shock was probably really bad. It was bad. So if this even works, it's gonna be bad. All right, ready? Three, two, one. Oh! Yes! Oh! Yes! God, that still hurts! Okay, there it is. Okay. That was worth it! <laughs> That was dope, dude. <laughs> that was yes. awesome. Lucille, it's nice to see you. That makes me already see that what happened to Glenn, very accurate. Yep. Three, two, one. Oh, I can go through both, but I tried. Oh, that was so great. <laughs> that was so clean. <laughs> that was so painful.